Hey guys, so it is 11.30, time for me to go to bed. Let me know if y'all like the red hair. It's, it's not giving how it's supposed to give because I just threw it up in a um, half ponytail because I'm about to go to bed. It looks hella messy at this the end of the day. But yeah, let me know if y'all like. What, babe? Let me know if y'all like this hair color on me. I actually really like it. And it matches my glasses. But yeah, so tomorrow is a big day for your girl. Oh my gosh, y'all can see me in the mirror. Yeah, I have no pants on. But anyways, it's bedtime, y'all. Hope y'all have a great night. And see y'all in the next clip. I'm going to sleep. Morning, Mango. Morning. She just ignores me. Morning, baby. Hey guys, so I just got out the shower. I did my makeup and I'm almost finished. I just have to add mascara. So there's a couple of things I wanted to do today. I wanted to go to Sephora and get a pickup order. I wanted to show y'all what I got in the mail, which is a few Forever 21 items. Also a dress from Scans. And I need to go to Target and pick up a few things. So I wanted to do that, go to Target, maybe do like a little fall grocery haul for you guys of a few fall things that I might pick up from Target. I changed my hair color, so it's really, I would say, an appropriate color for fall. It's more of an auburn color, so a little bit more orange than I usually do. It's brown with a little bit more orange in it. And I love it, guys. I really do love this color. Okay, so I'm done with my makeup. Trying to figure out what I should do with my hair. What do y'all think? Should I curl it? Straighten it? I kind of want to give it like this Jessica Rabbit curl. Kind of like a big wave but i feel like i can't do that with this so uh, i might put a little bit of waves in it in the next clip y'all will see what i do to my hair it won't be much it won't be much i'm done with my hair this is what i decided to do just put in some uh, loose curls it was really quick and easy let me show y'all in some better lighting now I gotta figure out something to wear today. So I think I'm actually gonna throw on that Skims dress, but I gotta show y'all what it looks like first. So let me just throw on a t-shirt and some leggings so I can do this little haul for y'all, show y'all the Skims dress, and then show y'all the, the stuff I got from Forever 21. Good morning, guys. Not sure if I said that already. Today is Saturday morning. I think it's like 11 o'clock. I think I got up at 9.30 today. I have a few errands that I wanted to run today. I have my ring on. Please don't come for me. I haven't opened this up. This is from Nordstrom. I think this is one of my Skims dresses. The other one came in a box. Here it is. We'll see how it fits. I'm so curious how it looks with the hype going around with these Gums dresses. I think I paid literally $75. Not sure, but I think it was a ridiculous amount of money for such a basic dress. It better do some magic. I got the marble color and the caramel color, both in a size medium. So yeah, I cannot wait to try this on. I'll try both of them on, the white and the brown, and y'all let me know which one looks better. So uh, here is the dress. It feels really nice. Is it worth 50, 60, 70 dollars? 
Does it make my booty pop? Let's see. I would wear this with my big hat in my bag, just like this. That extra. This is how I would take my Instagram pictures. This hair goes so good. Let's try on the white one. Oh my gosh, y'all. The white is so... Take my word for it. Is it giving me a body yaddy yaddy? I think. My cat loves to go to the neighbors, so I love that I can just shake her food. She'll come right here. Just watch. She's coming. She's coming. She loves to be at the neighbors. I don't know why she doesn't like to be over here. Hey, baby. Hi, baby. Let's go back inside. Go. Go, baby. You wanna be cute? Come here. Mm. She's so cute. Don't fall. Here. Want some more? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Works every time. I don't give her too much because she eats at certain times. I'm trying to maintain her weight. And ignore the fact that I have two of these. I'm indecisive. I didn't know which one I liked the best, the wooden one or the marble one. So I bought both. I had to buy her a slow feeder. And this thing is so ugly, but I think it works. My baby. Give the people a kiss. Give the people a kiss, baby. Aww. So greedy. You're so greedy. It's, does that refrigerator feel good? Nice and cold? Here. Here, baby. You can have a little bit more. So believe it or not, your girl got a compliment in her Skims dress when I went to Target. I was pretty surprised. I had a jacket on. Let me show y'all what my outfit looked like. I was like, it's Kim, this basic ass dress. And I got a compliment. I don't know if people are just really nice or this dress is actually doing something. And I was wearing a jacket on top of this dress. Let me show y'all, let me show y'all. So I had on this jacket. This is the jacket I was wearing on top of this dress. This jacket, I did a Forever 21 haul. And this jacket was in it, I'm pretty sure. So this jacket is from Forever 21. And this is what I was looking like in Target. Just like this. Yes, baby? Yes, I wore this to Target. And your girl got a compliment. I love this jacket, though. But she didn't compliment the jacket. She complimented the dress. This dress. What's wrong, baby? This dress, y'all. So that being said, Skims does something to people. I literally, like, I just, it's crazy. But yeah, I just wanted to show y'all what I wore to Target and that I actually got a compliment on this Skims dress, which I'm very surprised because to me, the dress is so plain and basic. But must not be that plain and basic if I'm getting a compliment. Must fit really nice or something. So it made me like this dress a little bit more. But let me show y'all what I got from Target. I just want to show y'all fall stuff that I got from Target. It's 
relatable for the season. So yeah, let's get all the fall stuff out and give y'all a little Target grocery haul. And the next grocery haul y'all will see will be hopefully like a Christmas grocery haul for all the Christmas stuff that I got. So it shall be fun. But yeah, so let's get to that. I wanted to do a little fall grocery haul for you guys. Everything is from Target, except for that. <laughs> we'll get to that. So the first thing is something I actually saw on, I think, Instagram. So Native has a fall scent edition body wash. So I definitely wanted to give it a try. I got the warm cider cinnamon. I also picked up the toasted marshmallow vanilla now this one i'm most excited about next i got some chocolate hazelnut wafers i remember eating these years ago while i was waiting on my hair appointment the lady doing my hair had some of these just sitting on her table so i tried them and they were so good i don't know if i was supposed to eat them actually but they were so good so i don't know what flavor they were but i saw this and i wanted to pick it up for the fall season i have tried them and they're a little bit too sweet for my liking next are these cookies they're the favorite day brand i think that's the target bakery brand but i'm not sure these are also favorite day these are the cinnamon churro cookie bites i have not tried these yet but i'm excited to try them next i had to pick up some hot cocoa this is the starbucks brand hot cocoa salted caramel flavor anthony loves caramel flavor he's obsessed with caramel flavor Speaking of caramel flavor, I gotta show y'all something. So I also picked up, and he's already opened it and tried it and said it was so good. I also picked up some Starbucks K-Cups for him. This is the caramel flavor K-Cups. So I think those are his favorite. Whereas me, I stick with tea in the morning. I'm not really a coffee drinker in the morning. So I just got more of my yogi positive energy tea all right so back to the haul so i'm not sure if these are considered fall but i picked these up i've never tried these before they are the gh craters it says they're handcrafted small batch popcorn this is the cheese and caramel mix and i think it'll taste so good when i think of fall foods i do think of Caramel popcorn, I don't know about y'all, so I just decided to add this to the haul. I ran out of my Bath & Body Works soap, so I saw this Myers soap. It is the apple cider scent, and it smells so good. Definitely fall festive. So this I got a few days ago. I've been using it every day now, but to be honest, I do not like the scent. I've been using it every day by default because I didn't have any other soap. I just got that native soap over there, so I will be using that. It smells so much better than this. I'm so disappointed. It is the OGX brand, and it is the coconut coffee scent. Like, I wish y'all could smell that and let me know if y'all like it. <laughs> okay, so I skipped a few things on this side. I picked up this box of cinnamon coffee cake mug muffin. I'm so excited to try this. I think it'll taste so good. And I've already ate some of this. Anthony and I already tried this. It is the Oreo pumpkin spice. Look at that. Ooh. Look at that. I wish y'all could smell this. It smells so good. So again, this is the pumpkin spice flavor. Definitely go get you some before it sells out. And I think I showed this already, but this is a candle from the beloved brand it is the apple cinnamon bark vegan scented candle smells so good like let me just let y'all can y'all smell that i got this about a week or two ago it smells amazing definitely go pick you up the apple and cinnamon bark it smells exactly what it's called like apples and cinnamon and not sure how much it cost, but definitely worth it. Have to say, better than a lot of 
Bath and Body Works fall scent candles. And then back here, this is not from Target. Well, there is a Starbucks in Target, but this is from Starbucks and I got it with my points. I thought it looked kind of fall with the orange, but then again, it looks a little summery with the coral pink color, but I still wanted to include that in the haul since I picked it up. And that is it for everything that I got in this little fall grocery shopping haul. I get a knock on the door and look what I find. Anthony is so sweet. I've always wanted just a bouquet of flowers being left at my door and he actually did that for me. There's a little note, so I wonder what it says. Just like the flowers are blessed with sunlight, I am blessed with the beautiful. I have a flag outside of my house. Let's just see if this can focus. Just like the flowers are blessed with sunlight, I am blessed with the beautiful and vibrant light that you give off. I love you, baby. Yours truly. Oh, that's so sweet. I got a box from Target. So y'all may think this is a grandma pillow. It kind of looks like a grandma pillow, but I just loved the colors. So I got this to put on my porch. Not sure if this is an outdoor pillow, so I might not put it out there. But if you're interested in this pillow, it is from Target and it is the Threshold Collection. Okay, so the next thing I got isn't that exciting. But I thought it was so cute. Can y'all tell what it is? Yes, I got a doormat. I've always wanted just a simple black and white plaid doormat for fall. So finally got that. And then I can put like a smaller mat on top and replace that gray one if you remember. I didn't realize how much bigger this mat is than the gray one. Let's get a comparison. So as y'all can see, it's much bigger than the other one. This one is 24 by 36. So two feet by three feet. Hmm. So I got one more package that I wanted to show y'all. Can y'all tell what it is? So to add to my fall collection, I got this cute dress from Target, the Future Collection by Kalana, and she is a black designer. How cute is this? It's made out of a denim material, so I don't know if y'all can tell. Love the buttons on the sleeve. It has buttons going down the middle and it has a belt to tie at the waist. Here's the back. I got it in a size six. A lot of people were saying it fit big. And then some comments people were saying it runs small. So we will see if it fits or not. This was kind of expensive, $45 at Target. There we go, $45 at Target. Kind of expensive. I am wearing the dress that I showed y'all in the last clip. I'm on my way to church and I decided to wear this and I actually really like how it looks. It's a size six and it fits a little bit, just a little bit big. So this is what it looks like. I love to pull the sleeves up a bit so it puffs up like this. The sleeves are a little big. I had to, I don't know if y'all can see it, but I had to put like a hair tie to keep it in place or else it would be like all the way down here, which I don't really like how that looks. I like how this looks better. The dress has pockets, which I love. Ties at the waist and there's a split at the bottom. So some people said that split was really short, but I think it's perfect actually. I love it so much. Let me show you all the shoes that I was wearing with this outfit. One second. So these are the shoes that I wore with this outfit. They are by Steve Madden 
and I think it gave a fall vibe to the outfit without having to wear boots or heels. Just slip them right on. I also wore these cute earrings. I love them. This outfit needed something. It needed a little bit more, so I decided to put on these earrings. And I think it looks really good with the outfit. I added a few little pumpkin decor, like these guys right over here. I also put this cute little fall decor by the front door. I love it. I think it looks so festive and fun. I did pick up another basket from, I think this is from Home Goods. I'm in love with these baskets. I have a few things in it, just a couple of fall decor that I'm not using at the moment. I decided to put this pillow in uh, the swing chair next to this pillow I got last year. The swing chair has not been mounted yet, unfortunately. We might not do it this year because I'm not sure where we could put it, to be honest. And these pumpkins here, right by the TV in my bedroom. Also stuck a, a few right there. Not sure if that looks a little much, but I thought it just gave what it need to give for the fall. Oh, you're being so cute. And then over here on my dresser, I just put this on top. I'm loving how it looks. Just put a few pumpkins in here. Everything you see is from Target. Oh, and my ring is up here because I needed to wash my hands. So I took it off and put it here. So. You might see me not wearing it, and that's because I'm still trying to get used to it. I accidentally almost ruined this thing. Okay, not ruined. But apparently it oxidized. I think that's the word. Because when I would take it off, I'd go take a shower, and I would just leave it in the bathroom for the night instead of putting it, like, on my nightstand. So I feel like because I left it in the bathroom while I was taking a shower, and Anthony was taking a shower, I think that's how it oxidized. But I got it cleaned and it looks brand spanking new. Do y'all hear the rain? I just wanted to show y'all how beautiful and peaceful it looks in my place right now. And then look outside. It's just so yellow outside. It looks like there's a filter. She put this wrist on. She fed up and said it went with your milk on. Turn a pandemic into a pandemic. You know that's the shit that we own. Them niggas gon' pull up and L at the shit that's together. Won't fuck with you home. Uh uh, I don't do the fake kicking. They go a rocket is taking it.